Hey everybody, John here with the Simplest Biz about pallet recycling business. I got Lily here with us today. She hadn't been feeling so great, so I'm having her hang out with me. Today I wanted to cover a few posts in the private Facebook group where people go that are students of the, the training for support and to share with what, what they're doing in their business for information to network between each other. And the last one, networking, is kind of, kind of what I want to speak about today. In this post, we have a student in the country here in the United States, and he is saying, "Any anyone want these free pallets in blank can be picked up monthly or can be a monthly pickup. And as you see, there's a quite a few of pallets in this picture. And as you know, in our training, we, we deal with all sorts of, of sizes and styles of pallets, and there are a variety of sizes uh, in this picture here and quite a few of them. So another member in the group is uh, looking at these posts, of course, and if they live in that area, they're going to take action. Okay. So this is the original post, but then there's comments below to give you an idea of what's going on. And now this same picture above, but the response is these pallets are now being picked up. Someone in the group has got them. So within a 24 hour period, uh, another group member has spotted the post inside the group and has taken action and has taken on this account. So this is not a one off, right? These pallets are being generated like this on a monthly basis. So in your mind, when you see something like this and maybe you're not participating, you need to understand that what you know what would an extra thousand couple thousand bucks a month let's just say this was your only account you know and you got it handed to you on a silver platter inside the group and now you have a atm of pallets being stacked up monthly and weekly even week after week month after month that are being given to you for free and you're flipping them and selling them to a business over and over and over and over and over again for a decade. What would that mean to your life? An extra thousand, an extra two thousand, an extra three thousand bucks in your pocket doing this type of deal. Okay, so I'm going to switch back over to this other one and scroll down just to kind of hit take this home for you. Well, look at the next post in the video. Ten gay lords, which are large boxes of these right here and 70 custom pallets of 32 by 28 skids. Not standard skids, 32 by 28 skids, an $842 profit before lunch. This could be on a Monday before lunch, and you've already pocketed as a profit at $842. What if you just did that Monday, Wednesday, and Friday any given week, or something similar to it, whether it be crates, dunnage, regular corrugated boxes, wire spools, all different sorts of pallets, and the numerous other items that we teach in the training. What would that translate to as far as time freedom and money freedom for your life? Again, $842 before lunch. What did you have to do this week to earn that $842 if you're not participating in this particular business model? How many hours did you work? How many miles did you have to drive? You have a lawn service. How many lawns would you have to do to do $842? This guy's pocketed it before lunch on a Monday, possibly. You know, so you do that a few times a week, like I said, and you start pocketing that money and getting time freedom and money freedom back. And I say this over and over again, but I'll say it again. When you translate each one of these units into profit for your pocket, we ain't trading time for money anymore. We're not trading a job for money. We're not trading salary for not money. We're working when we want to work, and we're moving pallets, crates, drums, dunnage, all the other items, and it translates into money in our pocket. Because what we determine to do is how many pallets, crates, or drums, or dunnage, or wire reels have I got to move this morning before lunch? to make the money I need to support my family.
So even if you wanted to incorporate this as a sideline business, <clears throat> where you even keep your job and pocket that extra a thousand, two thousand, three thousand a, mo a month, how would that translate in your life as far as more comfort, more reliability, more you know, a sense of security for you and your family because this is the way the business operates. And, you know, a lot of people have never seen this before, and I'll go off a little bit on a tangent. Well, I don't own a truck. Well, you know, you, you could do something like this by renting a truck on one day a week or one morning a week. You know, Home Depot has them for cheap. Now, you can't fit as many, but who cares if you have to do a couple more trips? So you can let the business uh, generate money and maybe save up to get a truck and, and not have to rent anymore. Borrow a friend's trailer. Cut a guy in a, you know, that you know that has a truck and a trailer in, in on the deal and give them a, a cut of the action for helping you out to move these items from point A to point B. This particular student right here is picking them up and going straight to the buyer is not storing them. These pallets are in great shape. They don't need to repair. These Gaylord boxes just folded down, ready to be sold, right? So actually I said 10 Gaylord boxes. I've got it cut off here. It's actually 40, I just see that right there. 40 Gaylord boxes. So these Gaylords go for quite a bit of money and that's why he's pulling $842 of profit. I wanted you folks to see this so you can apply it to your life and see if you can get in the mindset of being involved in this business model, having the training to teach you, and then having a Facebook private group with other like-minded individuals so you are not out there feeling alone. You have a support group, an information group, and you can share as well what you're doing in your business. So you scratch my back, I scratch yours. That type of thing is going on inside this group. My name is John Wilker. I'm owner of the Simplest Biz Training. Go to the simplestbiz.info for more information. The simplestbiz.info for more information.